So I've owned a Fitbit Charge 5 for about two months now, and it's an awesome device. Totally, totally awesome. But one thing that happened to me recently, which was like really, really weird, is I got to see what I call the five dots of death, as you see there. So it's the five dots at the top of the screen. It's a blank screen, nothing else. You can't seem to restart the watch from your watch face. You know, there's like no, no feedback when you're trying to move up or down on the screen. So it's just stuck like that. You might be able to see notifications, but then when you try to get back to the main screen, it just shows you the, you the five dots. So yeah, that's been frustrating. Now, I've owned many different Fitbits over the years, as you see here, and I haven't run into any issues until I got the Lux and then the Charge 5. And what happened there on those two watches is I noticed that when I go into the shower after uh, hot yoga, for example, I'd see the screen going batshit crazy as the water would come down. It would like, it'd just be like jumbled up, blah, 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 like that, all over the place. And I was always wondering about that. Well, recently I came out of the shower and I got the five dots of death, the screen of death. And it was like there's no way to restart it from the watch, like I said. And I thought maybe there's a way to restart it from the Fitbit app. There wasn't, at least directly there wasn't. But then I thought about something. I said to myself, there's got to be a way to restart this thing software-wise. There is. If you go to your Fitbit app, and you go to the gallery and check out these clock faces here. If you choose a different clock face, install it on your Fitbit tracker, ignore all of those stupid messages that say unable to detect device. Just let it finish. And when you let it finish and it restarts, you'll see the new clock face. And then if you want to go back to the previous clock face, you just select the original clock face. I had it on continuum the whole time. Like I then switched it to ice cream and I switched it back to continuum. And then you'll get everything as it was before. So awesome. So that's the secret trick. If you just want to restart your watch using the Fitbit app, you can do so. It's just in an indirect way. So this is for all you folks who don't have that charging cable on hand. I know there's a button on here that you press three times and then you can restart the device that way. But if you don't have this thing, like let's say you're out in the middle of nowhere and you don't have this thing, then you can still do this method and restart your device using this app. Awesome. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel where you'll see more videos just like this one. So until next time, everybody, see you. Bye.